cropping tool is used to help recompose a picture in a number of ways, the most basic of which is filling the frame with the subject of the photo, but it can also be used to change the proportions of the photo and straighten crooked horizons. Here's a photo of my dog Alfie taken on a phone camera. It's not a bad snap, but it can be improved quite a bit by careful cropping. The cropping tool is found over here in the tools panel. You can also press the C key on your keyboard and that shortcut will activate the cropping tool. Photoshop tends to remember the settings that were used the last time you used a tool, but you have a lot of ways of adjusting the settings once you start. Some of these adjustments are new to the CS6 version of Photoshop shown here. When you activate Crop, you will see these handles in the corner of your image. You can drag these around to manually adjust the crop. Clicking this button in the control panel at the top allows you to adjust the ratio of the picture. If you're printing the image, then you'll want to use the standard 4x5, which is the same as 10x8, or 7x5 setting and you can enter values in the boxes directly. This button, which is new in Photoshop CS6, swaps the height and width over and you can do this manually in other versions of Photoshop. Having set the proportions, now when you drag the corner handles, the image proportions remain constrained. If you click the clear button, you can resize the crop window to any size you choose. I want to increase the size of the subject, Alfie the dog, in the frame. The guidelines you see can help you to position the subject for best effect. I'm using the rule of thirds guides, which photographers were using years before Photoshop was invented. And this rule is said to produce satisfyingly balanced compositions, but you shouldn't worry too much about breaking the rules if your eye tells you different and you can change or remove the guides with this button. Another feature built into the cropping tool is the ability to straighten horizons. If you click on this spirit level icon and then draw a line along any lines that should be exactly horizontal, then like magic Photoshop will rotate the image to make the horizon exactly level. When you've made your adjustments, press enter and the image will be cropped to size. If you don't like the results, you can always undo the whole thing by pressing Ctrl or Command Z. And that concludes the basics of cropping. Thanks for watching.